It's described as the largest naval drill in the Middle East, and it kicked off Monday at the U.S. Navy's 5th Fleet headquarters in Bahrain. According to the U.S. Navy, the 18-day International Maritime Exercise, known by its acronym IMX, is not only the largest multinational naval exercise in the region, but also the largest exercise in the world of unmanned weaponry, such as aerial and underwater drones. It will include 9,000 personnel and up to 50 ships from more than 60 partner nations and international organizations operating across two regions. Its goal, to demonstrate shared resolve in preserving the rules-based international order. Our strength is in our collective partnership that we share with all of you, or you wouldn't be here representing your country. I think that together, we represent the ability to really design and execute the most robust exercise we have seen in this region. Spearheaded by the U.S. Navy, the drill will showcase other countries besides Bahrain, such as the UAE, Egypt, the U.K., Kenya, and Pakistan, to name a few. And beginning Tuesday, Israel will also be taking part, along with other countries with which Israel has no formal ties, such as Saudi Arabia and Oman. The IDF said in a statement that the exercise will, quote, strengthen our regional security and advance our regional cooperation. This regional cooperation does not include two of the region's main actors, Iran and Qatar, perhaps because it's sending a message to Tehran. And it could also be an indication of the growing isolation Tehran finds itself in the fast-changing region.